traffic. How's traffic doing? Ooh, traffic's getting quite heavy. Look at the traffic down here. Oh, yeah. But, you know, this is supposed to be New York. We're going to have traffic. And as long as it's like not massive traffic jams, I'm not unhappy to see loads of cars. Everything's moving, nothing's jammed up. We've got little traffic jams, but it's all moving. What about up here? This is pretty busy up here. This is a, a little bit jammed up. But you know what? We're going to be putting in more public transport and stuff. The Nanny Giggles roundabout is always a problem. But it's not backing up onto the highway anymore. So that's working kind of, sort of. This isn't backing up onto the highway. This is busy, but it's moving. Okay, so that's all alright. What about over here? Okay, this is a bit backed up, but again, it's not backing up into the uh, into the intersection. So it's kind of dealing with what it's got at the moment. Now, this is a um, little bit backed up here. Yeah, that's pretty backed up. It's because of these damn roads. You know, I wonder if we don't force the traffic to take a different route rather than going down here I, I'm you know what we're gonna do I'm gonna get rid of that road section which is gonna then force the traffic round this way or this way which um, might just smooth things out we'll see we'll, we'll keep on top of that um, how are we doing up here this is our new industrial area up here. And yeah, it's moving. It's moving. This roundabout is getting a bit sticky. A lot of heavy traffic though, so like what do you expect? These aren't moving. Come on guys, move. Lots and lots of heavy traffic. We may have to run, like, another highway up here or something. See, I could, I, instead of, like, this, I could actually run, like, a proper highway right through the middle. That's always an option. And then we've got the oil stuff going on up here. And this is... It's a, it's a bit sticky around the, around the train station, but, again, bearable. And I can always put another I'm gonna do it actually I'm gonna do it I'm gonna put in another train station which I, I think I said that like right at the beginning that that was an, an option that's a bus depot don't want one of those uh, train station cargo here we go so if we put this in kinda in the middle of this section here boom and we can hook up our train tracks I probably should do some nice curves and stuff, but for now, we're just going to do it like this, I think. There we go. Now, other people have said that um, I'm getting, like, train traffic jams because I haven't put in, like, a, a spur round here so that trains can bypass these stations. But it kind of looks okay to me at the moment. Yeah, everything's, everything's moving. I don't see, really, any problems. Um... Now, this, I didn't put a train station in for these guys. So, I think I should actually remedy that, shouldn't I? I think so. So, let's do that. Let's do that. Uh, oh, well, I was on the right place. Let's put in a cargo train station down here. Yeah, probably going to put it right, right in the middle, like there. And then we'll do the same thing. We'll just hook the tracks up, kind of. Oops, didn't want to do that. As um, as simply as we can. Boom, boom. There we go. Look, nice little siding. They can nip in there, pick up cargo. Now they can ship cargo like right into the the commercial centre. Uh, where is it? Down here. No, that's down there. Ah, see now, they can't because that is a... Yeah, we need 
a cargo train station. Now there's an interesting idea. Because that would get rid of a lot of the heavy traffic. Oh, I, I kind of like that idea. What about if we put in... Yeah, gonna do it. Gonna do it. It's gonna. I think it's gonna solve a lot of our transport problems. How about if we put it, it's like somewhere, like try and squeeze it in somewhere like over here. I have no idea how I'm gonna kind of do it, but I'm sure we'll come up with some. I could put it round. See if I put it round this side, where would the traffic then go? Mind you, it can go straight down there, can't it? Yeah, you know what? That's not a bad idea. Um, and then I'm going to have to put like a, a ring of offices around it because it's going to be so bloomin' noisy. Okay, right, we're going to do it there, I think. Right. Okay, so we've put that in. Now let's have a look at our noise pollution because it's going to be fairly horrendous around that train station. Look at that. Not good. So... What we need to do, we're going to need to remove the residential from here, put in some offices to provide a, a bit of insulation. So, guys, you're out of there. Uh, let's get my get my brush. So, yeah, all of you. Oh, we need to rezone that little bit. Get rid of those and. Probably up as far as there. Then I need to put a road in. Now, how? what sort of road am I going to put in? What sort of road am I going to put in? I'm, I'm probably going to go with just like a four-way going up here. There we go. That'll do. That'll do. That works. Okay, now we can zone that baby in. So let's... Um, Zone this in with offices all around there. We get again. We've got residential here that needs to be replaced with uh, offices. There we go. So now we've kind of insulated this um, this area. Uh, now we've got to deal with the train tracks. God, this is fun. So. How the hell are we going to do this? We are going to go page up. Oops, I went twice. I only want to go... Actually, shall I go twice? It kind of depends, like, what kind of slope I can get. Okay, yeah. So let's go up to there. Then we'll nip across the old road. Like that. Then we'll bring it down. And then we'll switch to the curve tool. Uh, although, this will do it for me, I think. Yeah, that'll do. There we go. Right, so now our cargo can be brought right down to here. And then they can just ship it straight into the heart of here. That should... That really should reduce our traffic. Like, considerably, I would hope. To the point where, like, this is pretty important because there's a hell of a lot of commercial traffic coming down here. If, um, this could solve our nanny giggles roundabout problems, guys. Let's see if we actually get any trains coming in here. It's operating normally. Because now goods can be shipped directly from this area, right, by train straight down to here. Here's one. Here's a cargo train. Peachy. And then what we should see is a flood of these cars coming out here. Excellent. The only problem with that is that they're going that way when really we'd want them to go the other way. But then they're going to go down here and then go in this way. Which, yeah, that, we can live with that. We can live with that. But that's cutting out all the travelling of uh, trucks through this area. So let's give that a little bit of time and we'll see what kind of effect that has. 
Here's another train coming in, bringing another load of cargo. Awesome source, and another one coming down. Alrighty, man, look at the look at that traffic. We're gonna have to keep an eye on this. Right, um, we're gonna need more subways and more more of everything. Look, loads and loads of dead bodies waiting for collection. This is what I was saying to you. Just having um, enough incinerators and, and cemeteries and stuff isn't enough. You actually need... It's the hearses to go and collect people that's the issue. So we're going to put in, I think, some more... I'm going to put another one down on that corner. I'm going to put another one over here now these are these are of course all members of uh, still members of the chain go away pop up of uh, smoking hot bodies <laughs> I do love that I do love that right so there we go so we've got another smoking hot bodies over there I'll, I'll, I'll try and get to them all like at some point um, we're going to carry on. We are going to put in... Did I just put in incineration plants instead of a crematorium? Please tell me I didn't. No, I put in... No, I put in crematoriums. Yeah. There we go. I, I've really, really worried. Did I put in... No, yeah, I put in crematorium. I did. Good lord. Um, where else? Where else? Because I think we just we just need to crank this up, I think. Where are we seeing? It's here! Like, why are there so many dead bodies waiting for collection over here? And not other places. Over here looks fine. Over here looks fine. We've got a little bit going on over here. But we've got the, um, we've got this one over here. We've got a smoking hot bodies over there. Uh, I'm thinking maybe we could do with another one in this area. But th again, there's no, there's no icons. Is it a traffic issue that's causing the problem? Oh, have we got some... No, those are just parked cars. No, there's no traffic. The traffic's fine. It looks like the icons are going away, though. Looks like they're, they're catching up with demand. Getting rid of those, uh, getting rid of those dead bodies. Alright, well, we'll keep an eye on it. So, uh, what was that? That was health. Uh, traffic... We've kind of been looking at traffic. This is heavy now. But this looks... Um, is this better than it was? I don't think it is. It's, it's backing up onto the highway. But it is just about keeping moving. Let's give it a bit more time. Uh, right, next. Uh, pollution. Yep, we know about that up there. This is not near our water pumps. But I don't think it was a problem anyway. You can see these guys, they reduce the amount of pollution, but they don't get rid of it. They do not get rid of it, so this is always going to be polluted. But it doesn't it doesn't actually affect anything, so it's not like a big deal. Noise pollution. We've managed to keep our noise pollution pretty isolated. It's not too bad. But have we used... Yeah, we've used the tree line roads. So even though traffic's heavy, it's not too noisy. A bit noisy around here. If we did do, do ah ah see I I don't think we used the trees around here. We didn't, did we? Right, no, well, there we go. Right, some upgrading. This is two lane. So let's um change it to two lane. Nice two lane. Oh, is this is this one way? Oh, this is one way, isn't it? It is. It is, it's one way. So, we need to upgrade it using this one. Okay, alright. Live with that. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, this is one way. Oh. Can't upgrade to this time. Oh, where's it? A bit of it's kind of flashing blue, but I don't think it is. Uh... Oh, this is all upgraded. Okay, so it was just this bit I didn't do. Let's check the old noise pollution again. Oh, see, look, it's got rid of all of that. So it's just... 
this is a bit noisy but it's just the heavy traffic and it's already changed it's already got trees lining this so we can't do anything more to that uh, what about up here yeah nothing more we can do because we've we've done all the uh, the tree lining and stuff this is obviously pretty horrendous down here I'm gonna have to do I'm gonna have to do something about you know what let's get let's get rid of these darn things We've got excess electricity. Let's change the electricity thing. Because I'm going to have to put in some um, some power lines, I think, if I get rid of some of these. Let's get rid of you. And you. We'll move it all offshore. I've had a couple of comments from people saying, you should move your stuff offshore. No point having these wind things onshore. Right, so in that case, power lines. And we'll just run some power lines up here. There we go. Just to make sure everything stays connected. Good, good, good. Oh, man. What next? D I, this game is so wonderfully hectic. And we've still got a few dead bodies waiting for collection up here. Are we getting on top of the situation? There's none over here, though. There, there's new ones popping up. But, oh, look. Loads of them. But see, they're disappearing. They are getting picked up. The hearses are going out and picking them up. There's just this one down here. That's kind of in danger of the building going abandoned. Okay, well, not too much we can do about that. We need to top up our electricity. Because I've just taken out a bunch. Let's top up a few of these. Uh, I need to spin that round that way. Uh, there, there. Let's put in, what, four of these, I think? Make up for the ones that we took out. Yeah, oh, let's bang a couple. We might as well just bang a couple more in while we're here. And I'm, I've been getting a bit close to this, so I'm going to move these over a bit. Uh, there and there. There we go. I could have put another, like, solar power plant in, couldn't I, really? Rather than expanding those. Could have expanded over here. What are you doing? What are you producing? Producing 160 megawatts. I crank another one of those up. We're making 27,000 at the moment. So I could certainly afford to do it. It's only 1,200 a week. Do we, do we put another one of these in? Start a bit of a solar farm over here? Yeah, what the hell. Let's put one in got the cash let's spend it right uh, what have we got demand for we've got demand for residential and commercial which is really good news uh, I wanted I want to get rid of these damn things what's our what's our garbage situation our incineration status is good what's the pollution situation here how far can we extend See, we can't really go any further than that that way. Ah, what I I guess what I could do. See, garbage is piling up. Uh, what are we going to do? What on earth are we going to do? I think what we're going to do is run a road. Uh, and probably just a two-lane road. Uh, that's upgrading. Stop upgrading. Thank you. Yeah, what I'm thinking is to run this kind of up here and round the corner and then we can extend this. This is going to be kind of, like at least for now, our main, main garbage processing area. So let's pop another one in there and there. Alrighty. And having done that, I want to start getting rid of these. So I'm going to empty that one. We should have plenty of capacity now in our incinerators. Yep, we do. We'll get rid of uh, these landfills. Oh, next. Fire. Fire is fairly good. But I think we could do with some coverage around here. 
about time we put in another fire station, I think. Maybe we put one kind of on the corner of Broadway, because it's got, got good access to pretty much everything from there. Oh, and look at it all go blue! Peachy. Okay. Uh, it's a bit patchy over here. Let's put in a... Let's put in a firehouse. I thought we'd already put a firehouse in over here. But apparently we haven't. Oh, this is a uh, this is an elementary school and a high school, isn't it, there? So about there, then. There we go, and it all goes blue. And everybody's happy. Excellent stuff. Right, next. Sheesh. Uh, so that was fire. Crime, I think crime is just generally everywhere very good. And it's just because we've got really good education. Educated people don't commit a lot of crime, so you don't need many police stations. So that's that. Uh, transport, how are we doing? We're up to 1,200 people a week on the, on the subways. How are we doing? We're up to 48,000 people, almost 50,000. Um, we're not doing a whole hell of a lot on the trains. And we're doing next to nothing on the Staten Island Ferry. What's going on with the Staten Island Ferry? You don't, I mean, maybe we just need, like... I mean, we've got a subway station over here for them to get around. I think... Look at all the death icons. Wow. But it's, it's, these are the ones that you need to look at. This is just where there's a, a dead person waiting for collection. And you, you'll always have those, because there's, there's always going to be people dying and waiting to be picked up. And they, you'll, you'll see them pop up and disappear. There, John just disappeared. Um, it's where you get a red one like this. Where somebody's been waiting for a while. Let's get rid of this info view so I can click on this building. Um, a dead person is waiting for transport. The building can become abandoned if nothing is done. Build cemeteries or crematoriums to dispose of the dead. I got a lot of dead bodies down here. I think I'm gonna have to. I think I'm gonna have to pop in another couple. Let's pop in one. over there and one there a lot we thought but that's a lot of uh, oh did I just put in I I did this time this time I did pause bonehead let's just get rid of those what a, what a maroon goodbye goodbye let's try that again so easy to confuse, though. Incinerators and um, and granny processing plants. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm gonna burn. I'm gonna burn, aren't I? Right, let's put that one in there, and we'll we'll sort that out and rezone it. Oh, did it? Did it not take away the zoning? I don't think it did. No. Okay. Good. Did it? Can't tell. No, no, it seems all right. Where did I put... I can't even tell where I put the darn thing in now. But I don't think it did change the zoning, which is good. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah, it did. Yeah, it did. Okay, right, that's done. Oh, man. Right. Like, just to pass through the info views takes you, like, a while to get through. What else? Um, so crime, blah blah blah, population, outside connections, yeah fine, land value, we do need to bang in more parks, we really do need to bang in more parks and get the land values up, uh, how am I going to do that, you know what, we'll do a very 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 quick couple of parks, I'm going to take a two lane gravel road and I'm going to run it down from there into here. In fact, I'm going to run it across behind these offices and then I'm going to put in, I think, like a couple of parks of... Park with trees. Can't get a second one in there. Um, man, that, that thing is really really big it's actually too damn big 
Let's. Uh, what about a small park? Yeah, that's more. That's more like what I wanted. There we go. Let's bang a couple of those in. I've got it on pause, haven't I? There we go. And do we start seeing things turn blue and upgrading? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Yes, we can. Right, you know what? Uh, we'll do another one then. Similar kind of deal. And I'm actually going to get rid of these damn power lines. So I'm going to run this down behind these buildings. Like that. And then... Uh, what was I going to throw in? I was going to throw in a couple of parks, wasn't I? The... Yeah, we'll use these again. So... Boom. Boom! Cool. We getting... Is it going blue? It's going blue! That's what we want. There is obviously a lot more of this that we need to do. Um... So you know what, if you want to see me do it, come back for the next episode, guys!